Let's solve this equation for x. Remember your steps. Are there any parentheses? In other words, is there any multiplication to be done? The answer is no. Do we have any terms that can be combined on the left side or on the right side? The answer is no. These are unlike terms. Now we want to get any variable terms, and this is the only term with a variable in it, by itself on one side of the equation. So I will add 5 to both sides of the equation. Here's my left side. Let's add 5. Here's my right side. Let's add 5. And now let's see what happens. You see on the left side, negative 5 plus 5 is 0, so I have 3x plus 0, or simply 3x, is equal to negative 11 plus 5, and that is negative 6. Now how do I finish solving? I'll divide both sides of the equation by the coefficient of x. So in other words, I'll divide the left side by 3 and the right side by 3. Why? Because notice the 3's divide out and I have 1x over 1, which is simply x. In the right side, I have negative 6 divided by 3. A negative divided by a positive is negative, and 6 divided by 3 is 2. The solution is negative 2. That means if you replace x with negative 2 here, a true statement will result.